This is a rebellion, isn't it? I rebel. So, they are like in this Star Wars family, which is kind of like, you know, I know the movie's about another universe, but the whole Star Wars family of fans and actors and creators is like an exclusive kind of group. Like, how does it feel to be like in, in that family and sit there at the Skywalker Ranch together? Can I, t I, I went to a con, like a con, uh, convention, like Comic-Con, yeah. and Mark Hamill was there. And I walked by him and I saw him and I stepped back and I said, Mark, and he kind of, you know, like, who's, I said, my name's Alan Tudyk, I'm K2SO. And he goes, oh my God, stopped what he's doing, gave me a no. hug, pulled me to the side. And he's like, man, okay, I talked to Gareth and I want to talk to you about the movie. That's, the, kind of, that's the family we're in, you can do that. What man. did he say, did he say like, welcome to the family? We talked spoiler stuff, so I can't tell you the stuff that we talked about. He he had a, he had a lot of secrets because he's Luke Skywalker. He well, can... wait, 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 he gave you spoiler stuff for Episode Eight? No, no, he. G oh, I wish. Why didn't even ask him? Oh, he, that's what he, he gave me. Spoiler <laughs> stuff for this. He gave that's that's what he gave me. It, it is a good family to be in. Yeah. It is a it is a it's a warm family. And, and when you do a movie like like this, does it does it feel more important than? I know all your projects is, are important and, and, and it's artful. You put all your, your heart into every project, but when you do like a Star Wars movie, does it feel more important than other movies? In a it feels different. In, it feels different in the sense that I've got a background mainly of doing indie movies, and you don't know if anyone's going to go and see those. So that's a kind of its own weird crapshoot. Whereas this is, you know, at least some people are going to go see this. So that's a kind of relief. Some, yeah. um, some is an understatement. <laughs> so no, so that's that's a big kind of difference for you, me. When uh, all movies, whenever you make them, have what, whatever the size, there are grueling days. You know, they're 12 hour days at least, 14, 15, whatever, you're towards the end of the week to get everything mud, rain, cold, whatever. And so there's always a moment where you go, oh, this is really hard. I'm having a tough day today. But when you looked around and saw stormtroopers and <coughs> spaceships and X Wing fighters, absolutely actual X Wing fighters there yeah. with smoke coming to the bottom and the ladder going up and guys in there working on them, it would buoy. You, at least me, you hated it. But for me, I was like, this is great. Man, yeah. man I hate this job. I want to go home. Mm. I want an indie movie. It was just... Yeah. Yeah. 10 degrees up. No, 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 no. No! Are you sure this is the way? They, they have landing trackers here. They have patrol squadrons. You've got to stay in the canyon. Keep it low. <laughs> There's a 26% chance of failure. How much further? I, I don't know, I'm not sure. I never really come this way, but we're close. We're close, I know that. Well, now there's a 35% chance of I failure. I don't want to know. Thank you. I understand. Now, put it down now! The wind! If you keep going, you'll be right over the shuttle depot! Watch out! Hey! And you bring in another uh, android character right. into, into the family. and it's, it's kind of amazing that all of us know the iconic R2, D D2, and C3PO, right. but now that they've been introducing these characters, they're like kind of like, it's, it's amazing how they blend into new stories, if, even in, in episode seven and, and right. now with your character. Like, how does it feel to play like one of those characters that become iconic and become toys and become? Yeah, I hope so. Um, uh, K2 is a different kind of droid. I think people are gonna uh, be excited to meet him because especially with the droids that have come before have all been uh, really good, friendly sidekicks, and K2SO um, is, although he's very committed and devoted to Cassian, um, he speaks his mind. Yeah. You know, there was a line that was cut at one point where he said, no one likes you. <laughs> <laughs> they talk about you behind your back and then you leave the room and, no, I said, they, they, when, you, when you aren't in a room, they talk about you, and when you come back in, they stop, and then when you leave, they start talking again. <laughs> Somehow that didn't end up in the movie. Yeah, I don't know weirdly, what happened there. Weirdly. Well, great, great movie, guys. Can't wait to see you guys. Cheers. Cheers. Really Thank good to meet you. you. Thank you. Okay, Thank see you later.